Ba da 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 da, once again. It's the Binding of Isaac. Rebirth! Afterbirth! Blah! Hey guys, welcome back to What's a Game, the series where I'm supposed to be playing games I've never played before, and once again I'm playing a game that I have spent, oh, like 600 hours on on Steam. That being said, I have a good reason for doing this. I just got the Afterbirth Plus DLC, I haven't tried it yet, and I wanted to break out the new character, Apollyon, here, and see what he can do. He starts with this item called the Void, well, Void, the Void is where the new boss is, and I don't quite get how it works, so we're gonna take him for a spin and see what happens. And yeah, you're gonna hear lots of clicking, because I play this game with a keyboard like a pleb. <clears throat> oh good, there's an item room. Alright, so what... oh wow. What the void does is it eats items, and like, that's Guardian Angel, that's a passive item. I think I would rather actually have that. Oh, Seraphim, excuse me. Yeah, that would be better. But if I had eaten that with the Void, it would give me, like, a random stat bonus. Well, speaking of which, I should see if I can turn on the HUD thingy. Pop-ups on extra HUD. Yay! I have all the HUD. I'm like some kind of HUD Oh boy. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and eat Steven here. See, and I got minus two range and plus two shot speed. That's... that's dumb. I kind of wish I'd picked that up. Well, let's keep going and see what happens. Plus 64% to my devil room chance? I don't even know how to read the HUD. Oh, wow. Ooh, okay, now that's useful. If I can charge this fucker back up, I can just eat that and I don't have to worry about not having a, uh, a bomb to get to it. Just like that. Plus speed, plus damage. Okay, that's nice. Oh, I know what, that wasn't a speed down that I got. That was a lowered tier fire rate, or lowered tier delay. So that's actually, that's actually a bonus. That's pretty crazy when you think about it, because I could just keep eating stuff and getting better and better stats. Oh no, it's one of these. Oh god, it makes it sound like a fucking pig in heat. That, ooh, ugh, I don't like those. Cr what is, what is with this? I'm not out, I'm not okay with this. Interesting. Yeah, I definitely want the HP up. Ooh, mom's knife, can I eat that? The answer is no. That was, that was a waste. I'm gonna get that though. Huh, and so your, your devil chance recharges at the start of the floor. I've, I've never seen this before, it's neat. I've been playing this game for years and I honestly have no idea how the fuck it works. Ooh, mushrooms. I haven't seen those before. They're kind of dumb. Okay, here we go. So, best friend is a shitty item. Go ahead and use it to blow that wall. And that didn't actually work. So I can wait another room, I guess, and then eat it and... I will be able to use it whenever I use the void, which is confusing because it's like, what if I just want to use the void to eat stuff? Ooh. So eat that, and now we've got. Oh yeah, and it, it activates immediately. So now we've got best friend till the end or whatever, and that's not necessarily a good thing. I, I, I don't know really what the purpose of that is. There's something I would rather eat. Damn, I'm not going to have enough charged for that. Yes. Let's go eat the kitty. Eat the kitty, I got a plus two. Ow! Fuck. Okay, yeah, so it dropped the best friend on me, which then blew up and hurt me, and I got a plus two luck and a plus two shot speed, it looks like. Which doesn't matter, because I'm using Mom's knife. So, note to self, when using the void, don't stand still. Oh, it took damage and it reduced my devil rune chance. How cool. Like, that it keeps track of that, not that I lost my devil rune chance. <laughs> That'll be useful though for, like, doing Mega Satan runs and stuff. Speaking of which, I'm kind of mad, because one of the things that Afterbirth Plus adds to the game is called Greedier Mode, which is, like, harder greed mode, which was, you know, new as of the last update. And... I had gone through greed mode with everybody, including the Lost, 
who is really freaking hard to play as. And unfortunately, I lost my completion marks for that because. Fuck! They're all back to normal, so now I gotta go and do greedier mode with everybody, including the lost, again. Boy, boy. Something's wrong. That's a new thing. Big Chubby. I don't know how he works. Oh, he just goes off on his own. You don't have to charge him, it looks like. Cool. I'm alright with this. Oh, I see, so just whenever I hit the button, he goes off in whatever direction. Okay, that's, that's cool. I like that. He's a good guy. He's helping out. So I can get a big speed up, or I could eat that and get luck up and... Damn it! And tears up. Let's see, if I could buy... Well, I have to be able to buy the Bible first, then I could eat it and use the void to kill the mom, which would be funny. Hey, that worked. Oh, and I could get Steam Sale. So we do that, and then we eat that. Awesome. Oh, God damn it! Eating things, it's awesome, except when they shit out bombs. I will eat the sack of pennies for... Damn it! Damage and shot speed, it looks like. Ooh. <laughs> I want to go back to just the glasses. There we go. Oh, what? Those things spit balls at you. So the weird thing about the void is it's like, I could take and activate it here and get to the Bible flight and get all that stuff, but then I wouldn't... Oh, cripes, why? I wouldn't necessarily be able to use it here, so it's like, you can use it for eating stuff, or you can use it for using stuff, and you don't have a lot of leeway to do both. Let's get that, because that's cool. And I want to save one of those for mom so I can just up and murder her. <laughs> the things that you say when playing this game. I think you can bomb that for stuff? Yes. All the pills. Oh, a poison mine. That's new. Ah, okay, yeah, that's a new thing. Right there, you can see the D4. So it tells you what the fuck this thing does. Because whenever I'm playing this and I get to a dice room, I always have to go and fucking look up what the hell dice rooms do, because I can never remember. Oh, why? Another steam sale? How... how does that work? I guess we'll find out if I ever get back to the door. Ooh, there's a... look up on the right over here, there's a little sack icon. That's new, I think. Possibly just because I've never left sacks in a room before. Speaking of which, I can totally get those. All set. <laughs> and a win! Oh, why? Oh, and... Now I wish I had a battery, because I could get that, and that would be awesome, but I can't. Because everything is terrible, I guess. Everything is terrible, I got that achievement. 2020 is actually making it hard to hit things with a knife, which is stupid. Oh, hey, look! That turned into a full soul heart, because I didn't have any half hearts. How cool is that? What is... that's moldy bread. That is an HP up. Awesome. Kinda need that. Sisters Viz. I hear they're terrible. I just kinda killed them in one go. Do I want that? I think I'm gonna eat that. Speed up and shot speed up it looks like. Acceptable. Aha! Uh -huh. Those brown ones actually attack you. Oh cripes, what the hell. Oh wow, how far... Oh hey, I got... I got a little brimstone. Hell yes. The candy conception was a good uh, investment after all. And that charge meter thing is awesome. And I got a dollar bill, because that's exactly what I need. Locust of Wrath. I got a thing. Damn, I've gotten all the frick the way up to the chest on my first go. That's not bad. Ooh. Technology. Let's see, dead bird. King's other eye. Technology. I didn't know it did that. That's awesome. And I can eat the poop. Oh god damn it. Wow. 
when you just walk into a room and kill four champion polycephalus instantly. What in the fuck? <laughs> I don't know if that's gonna work with Mom's knife, but we can eat Bob's brain for shit. I don't know what that was. Alright. Power pill. And I made milk's meat of the blue baby. Locust of Famine get. Alright, that didn't take too long. That was Apollyon, no longer just an edgy SCP class. If you enjoyed that and want to see more Binding of Isaac videos, don't ask me. Go follow a guy named Tour of Grace. Statistically, you probably already are if you're following me, but you never know. He's pretty funny, he's good at like self-deprecating humor, he's considerably more entertaining than I am in regards to this. Thanks for watching once again, and I hope you'll join me next time.